wish. Crush them! Hello, 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 hello. Howdy, everyone. Still waiting on Object to hop in, but I figured we might as well get started. Hopefully, he won't be too long. We all know how he is with the, uh, I'll be on shortly messages, though. Sometimes that means five minutes, sometimes that means five hours, so we'll see, <laughs> but... Excuse me. In the meantime, I figured we might as well get ourselves reacquainted with the game. Oh, excuse me again. How's everybody doing, though, man? It's been, what, about a week? Exactly a week, I guess, huh? Since we went on a uh, little vacation from not only Twitch, but just in general. Uh, Noodle and I ended up leaving for a little bit. It was, it was, it was nice. <laughs> it was honestly, it was really, really nice just getting away for a few days and whatnot. Um, we went and got pizza at a pizza place that we never had been to before. Uh, it was actually like an all-you-can-eat buffet pizza place, right? And uh, we get there, and they ended up being closed. Um, not the pizza joint itself, but the buffet part of it was. And uh, they were super nice about it, though. Like, we asked, and they were like, yeah, um, but go ahead and take a seat. We can cook you guys something up. Uh, and then explain to us, like, what soups and things they had. Asked us what kind of pizza we wanted thrown in the oven for for the buffet. And uh, we explained, you know, that it was our first time. And they were like, oh, okay, well, if it's your first time, then I'll go ahead and make you guys the pepperoni. Because that's what we had asked for, right? Just pepperoni. And they were like, uh, but here's what we're going to do for you. We're also going to throw in... Okay, that's a wolf spider. It's not happy. Uh, let's just leave. <laughs> I don't even know where I am. Oh, I remember where I am. Okay. Anyways, uh, they were like, okay, so yeah, we're going to throw in the pepperoni that you asked for, but then we're going to cook up a large with four different flavors on it, and uh, that way you guys can just have a little bit of a sampler. We'll also make you a dessert and our cheesy bread, right? Um, we'll put it all out here on the buffet for you, and then she comes out, and she was like, the server was like, oh, and don't like overstuff your guys uh, yourselves, because whatever you don't eat here, we're just going to go ahead and send it home with you. And it's like, dude, that was super kind to them. So, and the pizza ended up being really good too. Good stuff. It was good stuff. It's been longer for you? Yeah, it has been a little while. How you been, Hattie? Noodle, thank you so much, love. Appreciate the resub. Do you have a game you want that to go to? Oh, and while I'm thinking of it, uh, speaking of games, we did pick up a couple more games as well to, to throw on the list there of PS2 stuff. I threw on, or well, I, I've got um, a couple of Spongebob games, nothing too crazy. They didn't look as good as, like, the other Spongebob games or anything, but whatever. I had to get them eventually. I was hoping that would be all of the Spongebob games, but it's not. There actually is at least one more Spongebob game on the PS2. So there's that. And then uh, we got the other two Sly Cooper games, which that's actually pretty cool. Big Sly Cooper fan. Um, and to the best of my memory, one's the only one I've ever actually completed before. So, looking forward to two and three. Uh, but yeah, picked those up, got them added to the list as well. Friends! Okay, let me kill this, uh, ant here. And then... I will throw friends on before I forget. F, 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 friends. Five votes on that. Six. Okay. There we go. There we go. Alright, so this time our goal is... We were getting the stuff for the embiggening cocktail. I remember that. Um, we needed one more toenail. That was my goal was to collect the rest of the stuff for the toe, or the rest of the toenails for the embiggening cocktail. But, the one location where I knew there were toenails, there weren't enough. I did find another one, uh, admittedly with a little bit of help from a guide, <laughs> um, at the top of that tree stump that we just came out of there. The problem... Is that I have no idea how the hell to get up to it without a bunch of building. And I don't really want to spend the time doing a bunch of building. But, since... Ooh, that's another wolf spider. Since toenails are used in recipes, and the guide only mentioned there being like eight toenails total, 
I imagine there has to be like the toenails have to respawn, right? I don't I don't see them not res re respawning. So I'm thinking that we're just gonna go back to where I know the other ones are and check there. See if they see if they respawn. If not, then we're just gonna collect some of the other crap that we need. And then hopefully by then the toenails will respawn. I don't know how often things in this game respawn, but I know most resources do. The only thing I think that doesn't are the uh the rocks that you break to get the like marble and shit. What you use to upgrade weapons and armor with. And then of course the uh the molars that you use for upgrades. I'm pretty sure everything else respawns in the game. So yeah. Chocobo, what's up my guy? Hello, hello. I don't know how long you've been here, but I did mention earlier I got Sly Cooper 2 and 3. I know you're a fan, so figured you'd like to know about that. Oh, there's like this whole little army man thing over here. I didn't see that last time. That's cute. Somebody is playing with army men. I freaking hate mosquitoes, dude. Real life and in the game. Mosquitoes are actually the worst. <laughs> now, there's definitely worse bugs, but not in the game. In the game... Bro, where is this thing? That was terrible. Every single one of my blocks was <laughs> missed time. Okay, whatever. He's dead. Hello. Hey, he's here. We're live, by the way. So you don't say anything like, you know. Why are you so quiet? I don't know. It's my normal setup. Say something now. Hello? Oh, you know what? Hold on. Ooh, the lawnmower. This is new. What's in the lawnmower? Where am I, anyways, on the map? Okay, no, I'm going the right general direction. I'm also being attacked by something. Oh, there's an ant hill over here. That makes sense. Oh. Got a little bit of an echo there. What? Got a little bit of an echo from from you. Which was odd. Oh, I wasn't even talking. No, like, of my own voice. Oh. I'm not now. Probably it just I had you 200%, and then I realized <laughs> the reason you were so quiet was uh, my headset has a built-in mixer. And I must have uh, that'll do it. That'll do it. Chat. Yeah. Nate, welcome back, my guy. <laughs> <laughs> Saw you earlier, and then you just kind of disappeared, man. How you been, though, Nate? Chocobo, how you been, man? Happy to see everyone back after our vacation. Uh, Optijack and I also ended up trying out Baldur's Gate. Just the first one. Um, I did pick up the third one, by the way. Super excited to play it. But I'm trying my best to hold out until we play it on stream in, you know, two years or so. Uh, <laughs> uh, but we booted up the first one and tried it out. And, yeah, it was uh, it's a lot of fun. A lot of fun. Um... And then Nate, me and you have talked about Baldur's Gate on the PS2. I'm pretty sure the PS2 ones were Baldur's Gate Dark Alliance, uh, which uses, it does use the third edition rules. But Baldur's Gate 1, 2, and all of the, the games that came out around then used AD&D &D, uh, or D&D &D 2 rules, which a bit of a... Yeah. <laughs> As somebody that's only ever, ever actually played 5th edition, kind of sucks. Um, just because it's a lot more confusing, but it is what it is. It's not the end of the world. You been good? Awesome, man. It's weird that uh, Steam saves your um, web tabs per game now. Oh, that's cool. I didn't know it did that. Also, I may need to turn you up a little bit. As soon as I'm done being attacked by everything and their mother... Damn it, dude. It's never ending. I don't want to fight anything right now. Leave me alone. Go away. Okay, so what all did you end up getting it, getting for the Embiggening Cocktail, my guy? Uh, I was looking for the Koi Gales. I don't know if I got all of them, though. I think I did. I was going to say, I remember um, you saying at least one of the things you were looking for. I remember you saying you got all of them. Yeah, I think I got all of the scales. 
And then I was heading to look for something else. I just don't remember. Okay, um, I think I'm safe. Turn you up a little back bit. Here. Um. Ta -da. It looks like I don't have anything in my inventory. Where are we holding the beginning stuff at? Or did we I die? Like, uh, you might have died. I'm not sure. Which reminds me, I can do the backpack recovery real quick. That's the only one we get today, so make it count. But yeah, I'm not. I'm not sure if you did or not, my guy. I just remember whatever you were looking guy. for, you saying that you uh, had got everything. That's all I really remember. But I can't remember for sure. I know Koi scales were one of the things you were looking for, but I thought there was something else you were looking for, too. Yes, and they are great. You love Dark Alliance. See, from what I've read, Dark Alliance is a little more... Less like d and D and more just like generic action from what tiny bit I've read like it's still based on the d and D rules and everything like that, but it's more about like the action aspect of it. I could be very oh, wrong though like I said I haven't actually have. played it. I think most of them are yours, my guy. <laughs> I'm pretty sure the vast majority of them are your backpacks. I have so much in here. Oh my god. <laughs> I won't might be just able to recover all of them at once. I was going to say, you might just have to make a few trips between home base and the backpacks to dump everything. Uh, you weren't in here earlier, my guy. I was saying um, I'm fairly certain the toenails respawn. Because they are used for generic crafting as well. Uh, so my plan right now is I'm going to go check and see if they've respawned yet. If not, then I'm just going to help you collect the rest of the ingredients. And hope that they respawn by the time we come back <laughs> to it. Because, yeah, I don't know. I found that other another toenail. But I have no idea how we're going to get up to it without a shit ton of... Crafting or building, rather. They're fun co op games, but yeah, more action. Which, I mean, there's nothing wrong with that. And I do want to play them still, um, of course, but yeah. I'm really looking for more. Like, is it still turn based? Dark Alliance? I can't remember. Optijack and I just looked at it last night, but, but I can't remember. Bro, I don't have any skills. Uh. Maybe I dumped them? The guy just lied last time we were playing the game. Didn't collect a single scale. <laughs> like, <laughs> Can't recall. It's been a while. I'm hoping it is just because I definitely prefer that. I mean, okay. I say still turn-based. That's not quite right because <laughs> Baldur's Gate 1 and 2 weren't turn-based either. The Infinity Engine, which the original Baldur's Gates were made in, weren't turn-based games. Um, the newer one is, but... Not the uh, not the original ones, but I guess I guess more what I was wondering is are they, you know, like classic CRPGs or are they more like action games, generic action games? That's more what I was curious about. I'm assuming since you know they were on console that it's more like generic action game than CRPG, but I could be wrong. I mean, they had, like, on the PS1, they had uh, Command & Conquer and shit like that on there, so. Of course, it was recommended to use the mouse, but <laughs> you could play those games with a uh, with a controller, for better or for worse. Um... Well, that sucks. What? I only see one. For real? So you yeah. didn't complete it then. <laughs> what else did we need for it? Maybe you... 
completed something else. No, wait, there's another one. I have two. We need five. Maybe I just got them Oh, God. Out. Oh, God. Oh, I almost died. Oh, I have six. Okay, yeah, cool. Cool, cool. So we have all of them. Um, and then we need gum nuggets, which to collect those, we need to go into the ant cave and make a bunch of explosives. Ant cave, ant hill, whatever. But I'm coming home right now so we can take a nap. And then I guess we'll just start working on that while we wait for the toenails to uh, respawn. You bastard. Do I was trying to collect some pieces? water. I do. I do, actually, yes. Do we need them? I don't remember. I remember that we wanted them for something. I just don't remember what Oh, uh, you want them for the uh, fresh storage. Oh, uh, okay. You okay, can okay, also okay. make a large storage chest now as well. But they oh, also nice. take pine cone. Pine cone. Okay. I collected a fair few. And I know more or less where they're at if we decide we need more, too. Man, I hate how the waypoints just don't work in this game sometimes. Yeah. Like, I have no idea where home is right now. I mean, I know a general idea of it because I see you and the backpacks. So I'm assuming you're at home, so I've just been kind of going your direction. Yeah, I'm at home. Okay. What the hell's the glue masher? Glue masher? I have no idea. We can build it. And the grinder? Did we already have a grinder? Yes, I think. I might be thinking of... Uh, I might be thinking of the thing to use to make smoothies, though. I'm going to build a, uh, a glue masher, because I don't think we have one of those yet. No, I don't think so either. That doesn't even sound familiar, so. Home sweet home. Okay. Need to keep making web fiber. Or not web fiber, silk rope, rather. Oh, you can what make repair glue. The fuck was that? A oh, hauling hero. You achieve coziness level two. Coziness. I'm assuming that gives us like sleep benefits or something. Yeah, that's an, uh, that was a newer update thing. Okay. Gives you a reason to actually have like decorations and shit. I guess we need to put our food in here now. So what's this repair goo do, I wonder? I'm assuming it just repairs things. <laughs> I, mean, I know that's like, yes. yeah, but... <laughs> but it's uh... You can make it out of a bunch of different things, so like eight spider chunks. I guess I might as well make one. We don't really need... Uh, what do we use the least of? I would say the termite parts. No, we use that for our stuff. Spider chunks? Roly-poly parts? I have no idea. You can. We have 63 spider chunks. I'm going to okay. make... It takes yeah. eight, so... That sounds fine. Oh, don't craft that one. Okay. going to take a while. Um... Oh, and then I was going to build a chest just to sit our stuff for this quest in. Mosquito needle, I guess we'll keep that for now. Oh, God. Bee stingers, fire ant heads, pine cone pieces, grass seeds. There we go. This one is yeah, just for the quest stuff. items. Okay. Oh, I need to go uh, retrieve. I might have to build a bigger one as well once I get my backpack again. Why? Because I have so much shit in my backpack, and a lot of it's like For not this even quest? stuff that we have. Hey, what's going on? Oh, oh god. Oh no. Can we go to Why bed while this is happening? Mosquitoes? Under attack. No. Now. Shit. It'd just be nice if it was, like, morning. Hey, build right. some shit for this turret. Hey, well, at least you got that repair glue now. So. <laughs> okay, where are they at? Nah. 
It would have said it was over if that was the only one. This wall is about to break, though, if you still have your repair glue on you. Yeah, I didn't, it's, it's being made currently. It's not oh. being made yet. Ow. Oh, okay. It was, <laughs> it was two whole mosquitoes. Okay. I think we're okay. Uh, repair glue just got made. I got the wall. Wait, hold on. I want to... Okay, I, I won't fix it. that one. I well, I need to figure out what it does now. <laughs> like That's why I said I won't fix can, it. Oh, can re oh, okay. Can repair armor and weapons that have been upgraded past a certain point. Oh. Armor and weapons. That's actually pretty cool. So you don't need, like, the whatever the ingredient is for it? You can just do... Yes. You just, hmm. just do the repair glue. Kind of uh, handy. Do you want to go to bed? Yeah, I was just putting the berry leather in the uh, chest for quests. Anyone else tired? Just me. Oh fuck! All right. Hey. A nice nap. What can we make? We can make boatman fin suit. Water flea roast. Don't we have? Or no, it's tadpole roast is what you made. Uh, we don't have any berry chunks, really. Or nectar. We're out of toadstool chunks? What? Hold on. I gotta go collect one of my backpack or my backpack you only have one yeah could have swore i had some of that stuff that was go throw this on the jerky rack and then seven scoop and And then let's go get a drink somewhere. It's gotta be some shit around here somewhere. There's one. Can I get to it? Uh, well, <laughs> that's not how you want to get to it. Oh god, this game is what so was jank that sometimes. New mutation that we had. Uh, I got some sort of hauling mutation. But I don't think that was for both of us, though I could be wrong. I thought it Speaking popped up on my side too. Oh, we got a going? the base thing. For the base, we got um, coziness oh, level yep, or whatever. Yep, yep. Beautiful. Thank you for the five bits, love. Appreciate you. But I assume that just means like our food and water buff lasts longer. For the next level of coziness. Oh, hauling hero. Is that what you had? Yeah, okay. So we did both get it. Yep. Either that or you already had it. What does it mean by hauling strength? Oh, for bigger items. Yeah, I, was gonna, I think it's the number of uh, whatchamacallits that you can carry. Like planks? Yeah, planks and shit. RE4, nice. Bro, I'm so excited to be getting back into the PS2 stuff. I bought a uh, an adapter, by the way, um, so that I can use PS4, PS5, uh, modern Xbox, Switch, and 8-BitDo controllers on the PS2. It's not going to be here for like, holy shit, that's loud. Uh, it's not going to be here for like a week, but... I'm excited for it. It'll be nice, I think, to use a... Uh, probably going to use a PS4 controller, because I have a few extra of those laying around. Ah, oh, bow looks nice. I like our current bow. Okay, so we got... Oh, that... That's full. Uh, that's extra. That's... Get rid of that and that. 
and that and that. Okay. So now we should be able to make more food. Basically just making like all the food I can. Because I figure we can just put it in the fridge and, you know, hopefully it'll be fine. The only one I'm not going to make is the quesadil antlion. Quesadil antlion because we need the antlion parts. Yeah. <clears throat> um, so I need things out of my backpack. Did you steal my food? Yeah, I put it in the fridge though. I didn't eat it. I hear starving. Alright, so now we need to get baby ant uh, pods. What, egg, egg pods or whatever the fuck they're called. Hold oh, your horses there, broski. I'm still retrieving two more backpacks. Roo, so what's up, man? The... Welcome, welcome. So we have to do that, uh, that uh, sprint back to the base once yeah. we get it, right? Yep. yep. Uh, we should probably make sure we have everything else, too, before we go uh, to make the bombs. B-O-M-B. -B, bomb. And with the tier two... That words are fucking up. <laughs> with the tier two sub. Thank you so much, dude. I appreciate you. 21 months, man. Holy shit. That's like almost two years. <laughs> uh, do you have votes? You got 15 votes? Is there anywhere in particular you would like him to go, my guy? I'm assuming Scooby. But, yeah. Well, hold on. Right? Scooby. You could do Scooby. But didn't we get another game? Uh, we got Night of 100 Frights. So, you probably don't want to vote on that one. Because it already has 870 votes. So, chance, chances are. Sunday, that's what we're going to be playing. Sunday night. Mass Effect? Do I have that on the game's complete list? If not, I do plan on putting it on, so that's a fine vote. I don't think I do, though. I will add it right now. Mass Effect. I don't know what platform. Oh, wait. I don't know what platform. Yes, I do. PC. <laughs> that was dumb. True. It's valid. And it currently has 15 votes. Uh, 15 votes. There we go. I think I have Mass Effect Legendary Edition. I'm pretty sure I got that one. Because that's probably the one I'd play. It's the same, right? Mass Effect Legendary Edition, just like updated a yeah, little bit? Yeah, it's just updated. Okay. Yep, okay. Okay, that's two yeses, so it's good for me. So yeah, that's probably the one I'll end up playing then, is the Legendary Edition. Uh, but since, since, <laughs> uh, words, they aren't working for me tonight. Since the legendary edition has all three of them built into it though, I'm not going to sit here and say that we'll play one, two, and three all at the same time though. <laughs> Question, we'll play just one. No, not 100%ing uh, Andromeda it again. Andromeda like I did. I'm not 100%ing any of them again, dude. I 100%ed the first one. Well, technically I didn't because I lost my save right before the final mission after doing everything else in the fucking game. So, no. I'm just going to play the story and any of the side quests that uh, intrigue me. I'm not wasting my time running around barren planets for years. Like, it's just not <laughs> worth it. It's yeah, not I feel like doing Mass it, Effect 1 and Andromeda were probably worst. The worst, the one hundred percent. I really far. liked Mass Effect One. Don't get me wrong, but yeah, I love no. Mass Effect One. But the barren worlds, and the same for Mass Effect Andromeda, it should never have been an open world game. Mm -hmm. um, That's too just, nice. It, it's nice. too, too barren, and the quests just got really repetitive. That yeah, weren't like this actually main quest line. <laughs> Me three, great game, bad ending. Says Rue. I actually didn't mind the ending. Like, I understand why people don't like it. But it, it didn't, like, kill the series for me. Like, it did some people. Yeah. I, I mean, also don't mind Andromeda, whereas a lot of people hate it. I haven't actually, like, watched the ending for 3, but 
I don't know. From everything I've heard about it, that yeah, it's not that big of a deal to me personally. Like I still want to play the games. It didn't turn me off of it or anything. Especially I also need to put Persona <laughs> on the list. I mean to put Persona on the list. Yeah, when you play Persona, if you play Persona 5, you better make that a seven day a week uh, streaming game. <laughs> well, it's fine. We just won't do if you play it once a week. We just won't do any of the it. side uh, content. It's fine, bro. They're just main main story is like 130 <laughs> hours. What do you want about? There's no way the main game. I know. It, I know it's no, a long ass game, but there's no side shit because like. What you what you would consider side shit in that game is just leveling up, like it's how you level up your characters and like. Main all that story sort of shit. is an average of ninety seven and a half hours, sir. Ninety seven and a half. We can do that. It's all right. That'll just take what about four hours a week. So <laughs> that'll only take uh twenty. Five weeks. To uh, you're That's looking a at regular. Year. Yeah. Royale's 101. Oh, Royale. Okay, if well, it's main, still 26 hours. If you hours average a week. it out to all styles, Holy it's 123. <laughs> it's fine. It'll be about a half a year. <laughs> See, <laughs> that's what I mean. Like, <laughs> the game itself is just long because the completionist aspect of it is only 20 hours more. Yeah. That's not that big of a difference. Wait. On one, it said that the completionist was 170 hours. Yeah, on Royale, it's 143. All wow. styles is 123. I wonder Main why completionist. Is 101. I wonder why completionist is so much shorter on Royale. Um, I don't know what all they changed. So the dun the the palaces are different in Royale. I don't know if they streamlined them and made them easier to find everything. Um, I don't know. There's extra content, though. So, like, I don't know why it would be shorter. But I... Wait, this isn't even the right Ant Hill. We what, want the, the Ant Hill. Animal? Yeah, no, I was at the one next to the to the tree. We want the one next to the base. Oh, I'm, yeah, I'm at the one with you. Doesn't it connect? No, I don't think so, at least. Which one's the one next to the base? I'm guessing this one? I don't know why I would have used an arachnid. Wait, is that that's, home? Where's home? No, there's home. The arachnid is... That's where the spiders are. Stairs that's that machine. one, like, log, isn't it? I just remember... So, from home... I don't know. I'm going to go check that, I think. Because there's no flags down here for some reason. Bro, come here. These ants are like hey there, right in or oh, something. you're down there. I don't know. I'm in some, like, mass. <laughs> They're sleeping, dude. <laughs> They're... <laughs> I mean, maybe it was... I'm... No, it definitely wasn't this one that has the, the eggs. Bro, they, they are all just like chilling. Is this because of the brain? The orc thing? Shit. They don't have yeah. orcs on them. Is there some yeah, because this is the one that just ends right oh, up this here. This pissed off. This is the first one we found, the one that you spent forever getting up in there. Oh, yeah, doing that jump. Mm hmm. And ended <laughs> up not being it worth it at sure. all. Yeah, no, it's definitely not this one. It's back to base. For me. You can do whatever the hell you want. Fuck, how do you get out of here? Bro, I can't see shit. You go, you go up, up. There it is. Up here. <laughs> uh, wrong way. What are you talking about? I, I went the right way. To leave? Yeah. Oh, fuck. I didn't even see you, dude. Legitimately. Oh, does it connect? Does what connect? No. You went the wrong way. Yeah, I know. So I said I legitimately didn't even see you. <clears throat> yeah, you have to jump. Ah, uh, over here. Sledge. I see it now. 
I have HDR enabled on my monitor. And, like, Windows does its best to hey take a non-HDR game and make it HDR. I don't think it does a great job all the time, though. Why? What's it doing? It was just kind of blown out in there. Like, I couldn't see shit. Lily, what's up? <sighs> Taking a drink. I will disable you. Just a warning. Ah. Uh. Um, all right. So, back home. I remember, like, vaguely which direction we need to go. I just don't remember where exactly the anthill is. I'm pretty sure I had a marker on it at one point, but... Yeah. Noodle! With the, <laughs> the dance. Why are you dancing this time, love? Is it just uh, to get us hype? Okay. Why is Lele crying? Because I said I'd disable her. Because <laughs> she just wants to make me drink nonstop. That's her plan. You will not? I will. <laughs> you can't tell me what I will and won't do. I'll disable her if I want to. <laughs> Alright, so you come to the surveyor. And then you head towards the dead grass. And it's like right here somewhere. It's pretty close to home. Yeah, there it is. I already found it. Fighting an orc. So it's oh, like my right... Man just spawned. Right here-ish. Okay, it's actually a little too far. It's actually like right here, I guess. Yeah, that's better. She was very no nice and helped us last night. She did help us last night. That's true. I'll still disable her if I want to. <laughs> How for not? Don't matter to me. What's interesting, so, Wendell? <clears throat> How many things do we need to make? Uh, bombs? Well, we need at least five gun drops. Because I think we only have one. So probably at least four. Because I'm guessing you only get one per gum that you blow up. And we need one ant egg per yeah. frat burst. And then we got to try to book it back home with them too so that they don't explode. Because if they explode... Curious. Yeah. Then we got to wait for them to fucking respawn. I'm curious what the frat burst is used in. It says it's used in one recipe. For something, yeah. Okay, I found right. one. I didn't pick it up yet, though. Because I'm hoping to find, like, Attack two or three. Yeah. Die. Yeah. Almost fell down the fucking hole. Bro, if they could just stop. I, I'll eradicate the entire species if I have to. These ones, like this ant hill, yeah. is fucking windy, too. Like, like it's bigger. It's a lot bigger. There's a lot of winding paths and shit. Uh, I think I just killed the entire colony. Oh, my God. <laughs> Are you still in the Bro. old one? No, I'm in the new one. If you walk outside, it's a graveyard. Careful you don't kill too much, because remember, you can prevent them from laying eggs like you can destroy the colony at least that's about what there. david has said well we don't want to do that because we need them to keep producing eggs i'm sure there's another like place to get them i was but... about to say because david also played this game for 10 whole minutes <laughs> fair fair I'm not finding any eggs. I found one fucking egg. That's it. Holy shit, dude. Yeah, there's a couple of them here, huh?
She should be set on uh, amp parts for a bit, though. Yeah, we should be. Uh, yeah, no, you can't kill all of them. You can't kill all of them? What do you mean? No, that's, that's not a thing. Like, you can't eradicate them, you mean? No, yeah. Okay. They respawn after a while. So I feel like I should ask, what is get... the objective of Grounded? So, unlike a game like Minecraft that has no real objective, I mean, I guess it does these days, right, with the ending. Um, there is a story, though, to Grounded. And right now, we're actually at the end, basically. Um, so, the objective is to unshrink yourself, right? Because you were kidnapped and shrunk against your will and put in this yard. So your goal is to unshrink yourself. That's the that's the objective. What we need to do for that at the moment is create some sort of cocktail that can fuel our bodies when we're taken back up to our, like regular size, so we don't just die from the process of being deshrunk. Um, that's our like current goal. But before we face the final boss and actually unshrink ourselves, there's apparently a secret boss that'll give you a good ending. So we also want to try and do that, but we don't 100% know how to do that yet. <laughs> Still got to figure that out. How do you get Round the toenails? Gum. Uh, you just find them in the world. There's a couple different spots that they spawn at. I'm hoping they respawn. I'm pretty sure they will, but yeah. All right. Resources. Uh... Wait. I got an egg. I got an egg. I'm running. I only got one. He was carrying it in his mouth. I slapped him. <laughs> Wait, how do we make the... You take it to a uh, crafting bench. And then what? And then it's just in the crafting menu. What's it called again? The Rob burst. Rob burst, okay. Yeah. This is saying, now there's been a lot of updates, so maybe it changed, but this is saying that gum nuggets are harvested with a black ant shovel. Bro, he's following me. The ants are following, they followed me to the house. Oh, God. I'm coming uh, to bro the house. Burst, bro burst. But if that's the case, that's not bad at I all, man. One. We can easily just find them and then fucking... Okay, we'll keep that one. I'm going to go double check the gum. I mean, you can do whatever you want, whether it's continue getting I'm more brop burst or... Be good okay. for a, uh, if we don't use them Oops. now, we can use something. I'm going to put them in with the... Um, the uh, end game basket. Uh... Gone real silent. Yeah, give me a sec. Oh, there we go. Okay. I decided to finally switch my cord <laughs> for my mic because it just came unplugged on me again. But you can hear me now, right? Yeah. Okay. Gum nuggets. Uh, survey. Okay, well, apparently they're fucking everywhere, so... Uh... Hang 
Okay, well, the only place I know of at the top of my head um, was, wasn't there one under the porch? I don't recall, truthfully. Like, stuck to the bottom of it? I'm pretty sure there was, like, on the other side of the haze. So I'm going to head that way. Do I have my... Rebreather thingy on me. My gas mask, yes. I have a black ant wow, shovel. Really don't like shovel. When you take the eggs. Right. Well, yeah, I wouldn't imagine, man. It's literally their, uh, you know, children. Be like if somebody came I in your house, like stole your baby, and said, "Hey, I need this to make an explosive." You know. <laughs> Can't imagine you'd be too happy about that. <laughs> I think I'd just be in shock. <laughs> Curious. Uh. All right, let's see. Oh, fuck. I almost went down the hole. Lele, you're on thin ice here, dude. <laughs> nah, it's fine. I'm joking. I'm picking on you. I have it limited anyways. You can only do it like five times or something, and then, <laughs> and then it'll automatically uh, so we cut have, you uh, off. We have eight robbers now. No shit. Nice, dude. Do you get more than one for each egg, or did you just find that many eggs? I just grabbed, I, they had a little collection, and I just stole all of them. <laughs> nice, dude. Okay. Perfect, then. Posture check. Isn't my posture pretty good already? I guess I can sit up a tiny bit straighter. Okay, I'm not being attacked now, so I'll hydrate. Bruh, fucking... <laughs> the brain in a jar following me around Wendell scared the shit out of me. And a stretch. Okay. You know, OptiJack and I are trying to finish this game. <laughs> Y'all are going to make it really hard. Hold on. Uh. Check. And I think I'm being attacked. No, maybe not. All right, I'm stretching. There you go. You happy? Oh, <laughs> big stretch. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everything I forget where the hell I'm going. Okay, this way. <laughs> Shit, that's a big hole. That's what she said. Or no. Wait, what? <laughs> uh. Go away, you mutated freaks. That's what she said. <laughs> Go away, you mutated freak. Do we need bombardier parts for anything? <laughs> Not that I know off the top of my head. Cool. I feel like the haze has gotten worse. Again, it might just be because of the auto HDR and the fact that it's currently nighttime. Yeah, right there. There's a gum nugget. What the hell? Why is there a red worker ant just dying in the fog over here? <laughs> Where the hell did you come from, little guy? So, Aha, it is possible. Okay. Damn. Gotta swing first and then jump. Swing and then jump. Hey, let's go. Okay. One, two, three. I got three. I think I think we have one at home. Gum nugget. 
Gum nuggets? Uh, yeah. Check. We currently have. You have none in here. I don't know. You yeah, no. Chest. I didn't like just collect it recently or anything like? like that. Uh, like a little piece of chewing gum. Are they pink. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, they kind of look like a brain, like Rue just pointed out. <laughs> yeah. Either way, though, um, we need to find at least one we have more. Four. Wait, what? There's four of them there? Four gum nuggets, yeah. Oh, shit. Okay, so that's all of those then, because I just got three more. Nice. And we needed five. So I'm coming home. So then I think the last thing we need then is just the uh, toenails. How many of those do we need? One more. We need five total. I know where one's at. If it comes down to it. But I'm pretty sure it respawns. Because most things in this game respawn. So I don't think we should have to get that one. I think we just have to wait however many in-game days it takes for things to respawn. And then we should be able to just get it from there. The easy location that I know. What are you? Oh, just a pebble. I don't need a pebble. I don't think we need any more clay at the moment. Bro, this haze be hazing, though, you know? That shit is True. thick. It's dark. What the hell is a twinkling? Why do we have four shells of it? Four shells? Yeah, from a twinkling. I don't even know what that is. I have no idea. <laughs> is that like some fucked up name for a firefly? No, it's some shiny, almost looks like a termite. Oh, or not fuck. a termite, looks like a... Um... I fell in the hole. Oh, it's a scarab. Oh, I can get out of it right here. Nice, okay. Yeah, I have no idea, dude. Take off that fucking mask. Better safe than sorry. Oh fuck, dude, I'm stuck. Eaten alive by red mites. Gross collecting gum XP. Then again, this game has a lot of gross for me. Yeah. I mean, with all the bugs and shit. Yeah. That's fair. Alright, you want to go to bed? We need the Black Widow fang for anything. What do you want it for? That's the real question. You know. No, oh I don't. Oh my god, that's huge. That's like an actual size. <laughs> just, let's, let's go to fucking Decorating, bed. Decorating, boy. Hold <laughs> let's on. go to fucking bed. Bro, I thought we were trying to beat this game. What the hell are you decorating for? Because now's the time to do it. Now's the time to sleep. Decorate in the morning when I'm looking at the... Uh, what you call it? The I toenails. Made. Jesus Christ, dude! <laughs> that thing's fucking huge. Mm -hmm. uh. I better dong whenever we wake up. <laughs> no, we slept in. Oh, it does dong. Yes. Does it? I didn't hear it. I did. It's all that matters. Mm. Okay. I'm gonna go see if the to toenails respawn, dude. While you decorate shit. I guess I don't need to keep burning that. It's a waste. Uh, I should probably eat food, actually, and grab some drink before I leave. It's not that long of a trip, but still. I could devour a Billy Hawk right about now. You're going back to school? What for, my guy? You got like a uh, major in mind or anything like that? Or are you just trolling? Where am I going exactly? I'm going here. On the wrong direction already. Nice.
I'm considering it, to be honest with you. Going back to school. So my employer will pay for it. The only thing, the only reason why I haven't already is because I'm hoping to not be at this employer for, you know, two to four years. <laughs> so I'm that's the hope at least. Life, <laughs> like, <laughs> but we'll see. We'll see. I am considering it though. Or at least taking some certification classes, if nothing else. Real, starting October, going for a Bachelor of Education. Nice. So you want to be a elementary school teacher. I mean, we always need more teachers, man. There's nothing wrong with that. I don't think I could do it personally. I love kids, but I don't know if I have enough patience to, like, have a whole classroom of them, you know? Like, I could watch one or two kids for a day, but watching an entire classroom of them for a day, I just don't think I could do. I like kids, but not that much. But no, that is good, man. That's awesome. Good for you. Good for you. And here I hate kids. <laughs> Noodle. Oh, God. You hear that? Noodle said she hates your kids. Damn. I know, right? It's rude. Oh, bee pollen. I've debated on it for a while. It's been one of the big jobs you thought about since I graduated. Said, if nothing else, like, I feel it's definitely a necessary job. And uh, as long as you're not one of those teachers that obviously just hates children, <laughs> it doesn't make sense why they even got into it to begin with. As long as you're not one of those people, then <laughs> it's, it's probably a pretty fulfilling job, too. Right? Like, uh, has a real sense of purpose. It gives you a real sense of purpose. Respectable, yeah. Definitely. No, that's awesome, though, man. Seriously, good for you. Is it something that your job pays for, or is it something you're going to have to pay for? I enjoyed them very much. Thank you very much. I uh, enjoyed enjoy them. Whenever she's puking all over the place. <laughs> good time. I, just saying you enjoyed them very much sounds like <laughs> you're a fucking cannibal or something. <laughs> like, <laughs> I, don't, I don't know if that's the way you want to put it, love. That's... <laughs> that's <laughs> oh, I stayed away from the puke, yeah. It wouldn't have just been child puke that you would have been cleaning up if she saw it, man. God, I'm so glad I built this fucking thing. This is a blind. I should have brought more shit to build more zip lines. Going up. Oh my god, she built a house and it was beautiful. <laughs> yes. <laughs> She is literally, I mean, both of your kids are, like, the most social people I've ever met in my life. I don't know where they got that shit. <laughs> yeah, same, dude. Fucking same. Nobody in our family is sociable. <laughs> like, nobody in our immediate family likes people. And uh, I don't know her family that well, but I know their mom, and she doesn't seem like she wants to, like, I wouldn't call her an extrovert, you know? Yeah. So, <laughs> like, I don't, I don't fucking get it either. Yeah. Fuck socialization, exactly, dude. This streaming shit is all the socialization I need in my life. <laughs> I get to spend time with my friends online, as God intended. Speaking of God, um, did you guys know? Do you? Does anybody here watch Rhett and Link? Um, yeah, I haven't watched them in a while, though. Rhett has his own solo band. He only released one album, because it's while he was, uh... It was during, like, the, the lockdowns and shit like that. Um, he had a bunch of free time on his hands, and one of the things his therapist suggested that he did was write songs. Since, you know... Ooh, coziness level three, very nice. Anyways, oh, shit, we got a hot um... Tub. <laughs> Since he <clears throat> was already a songwriter, the the his therapist suggested he write some songs to help him work through some of the problems that they were talking about together and whatnot. And uh, then after he did that, the therapist was like, "Hey, this is good stuff. I think it would be 
nice if you released it or whatever. So he did. He actually turned it into a full album. Um, the reason God made me think about that is because I didn't know this about Red. He used to be like a devout Christian. Like they grew up in her. yeah, grew up okay. in like a devout Christian. I'm pretty sure Link was as well, but I didn't read into the his history as much because he doesn't have his own solo band. But uh, <laughs> anyways, um, devout Christian. He was even like a missionary in his 20s, like full time and whatnot. And uh, anyways, and then he he eventually stopped <laughs> being one and that's what the majority of the music is about i'm assuming that's what a lot of his therapy is about is you know the disapproval of his old friends and family and loved ones and whatnot from uh losing his religion but anyways it's good it's like uh folky uh with a bit of elvis thrown in there for good measure kind of sound and uh yeah Used to be a counselor at church camp. I did not know that, my guy. That's uh, that's interesting. I mean, I was pretty active in the church when I was younger, but I I gave up on religion young. <laughs> like, fuck, they haven't respawned yet. Uh, but anyways, yeah, I was probably like, by the time I gave up, gave up, I was probably like fifteen or something like that, maybe sixteen, when I completely gave up on religion. Started having questions probably around thirteen ish. Oh, shit. You good, homie? Yeah, if you uh, hit E on the uh, on the mounts, they they make noises at you. I did that <laughs> on one of the spiders. <laughs> Thought you were being attacked? <laughs> I didn't know what was happening. My whole screen shook. Oh, God. Your phone died? Hey, at least you didn't die, dude. Uh, I'm trying, but you know. Sorry, don't send me letters, YouTube. I'm fine. It's a joke. Chill. I only want to die sometimes. Ah, uh, fuck. Okay, so they haven't respawned yet. I'm fairly certain they do. But unless you want to try and help me figure out how the hell we going to get on top of this giant stump over here, there's nothing to do but wait until another day passes and then just keep coming over here and checking. Yeah, give me one second. I'm wait, doing shit. to which one, dude? <laughs> I mean, I can help you go find one. I don't care. I, I don't think getting up there is going to be worth it. We'd have to get a lot of clay to get to the top of the area where it's at. A lot of clay. Uh, by the way, I'm very upset. I can't make the hot tub. We have to have ever char cool chunks. I've never even heard of that. Me neither, dude. <laughs> I'm guessing that's some sort of a charcoal. I don't know. You had a whole meeting on blank prevention today? Okay, then. <laughs> I, did, I, did, I didn't know that's something they uh had you guys do, you know? I mean, I guess it's a good thing, but it's unexpected. I need more dandelion tuft. Oh my god, Lily. Uh. Is the stink bug gonna leave me alone? Okay, yeah, stink bug left. I need you! Oh shit, that's not what I wanted to do. Three. Wait, where'd my dandelion tuft go? Did it fall in the water? Bro, what'd it do? Fucking despawn? Son of a bitch. There's another one over here. Ah, oh, that bug's gonna attack me, though. You don't so see me. What's the game plan, sir? Probably just sleep as soon as humanly possible. And then keep checking the spot. Because it's been, well, two in-game days since we started playing today. And it had to be at least one or two in-game days before. So presumably, it respawns within like a week. Hope. <laughs> You're talking for the toenails, right? Yeah, for the respawn on it. 
I mean, there might be. If we look at the wiki, there might be more places we can find them. But the only one I found other than the easy spot to get to is fucking impossible without building a shit ton. I actually had a therapist that gave good information and all, so it wasn't bad. Rough because of topic, but decent presentation. I signed a contract. I'm not allowed to. What? Off myself. Oh. It glows red for the resource, right? Uh. Oh, huh. Glows red? I don't think so. Yeah, on the resource analyzer. Oh. I don't see any red glow. What are you analyzing? I, see, I see the toenails. I see two areas. Three. Three areas that they're in. They're all north. That is glowing red? Yeah, there are three little oh, red squares. Oh, the little, little squares. Okay. Yeah. Um. I mean, we can go check them out. In the meantime, we got to waste time anyway, so we might as well, right? Said one of those areas I already know is basically impossible. I don't know which one it is, but... This one looks like it's the easiest if it's still there. I'll mark that. The one next to the tree stump, which I think is this one. Here? Either that one or... Oh, no, this one. This one is pointless. What I would ignore that one. Uh, it's either an axe or hammer. I don't remember. But, I mean, I'm going to come with you. We'll literally go together. I just got to catch up to you. I'm only 50 centimeters away, though. I'm <laughs> glad that you're holding to your contract. I don't think it's legally binding, to be fair, but, you know. Because one, contract? the thou shalt now off themselves contract. Yeah, who? Who do you sign that for? What? <laughs> One of the uh, therapists. Oh. That I, or well, it wasn't actually the therapist that had me sign it. It was like the the business, the the whatever you know, the office. Because like I had to talk to a bunch of like caseworkers and shit, and then they assigned me to a therapist and psychiatrist and whatnot. And anyways, it was during all of the drug testing and uh, talking to different people to pick a therapist and all that that they made me sign a contract like you don't remember signing that I don't know if that's something normal they have people do or not <laughs> um but yeah I did sign one again don't think it's really legally binding cause one minor two uh how would that be binding sir we can't get up over here so you might want to go this way first We gotta go over there by the coal. We don't have to go through the coal this time, though. At least, what are they gonna do, Sumi? Exactly, dude. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, hey, I hate my life enough that I'm gonna try to off myself. Uh, okay, we'll just sue you to make your life worse. That makes a ton of sense. I don't, I don't get it. I, I guess it's just like, I don't know. I, I literally don't know. Like. You had a spider on you? <laughs> That's gonna... Bro, did I tell you guys about... Oh, it must have been like two weeks ago now. Noodle and I went to get ice cream. And I got out of the car and I was trying to look at the, the sign to see what like flavors they had. And there was something in front of my face, like on my glasses. I thought it was like a speck of dust or something. So I pulled my glasses off and it was just a tiny little spider, dude. The tiniest spider hanging on my glasses. Um... Oh, fuck you, mosquitoes. Anyways, I got him off. And, uh... Oh, shit. Okay, hi, Mant. <laughs> Every time that thing spawns, I get fucking scared, dude. Anyways, I got him off the, my glasses, let him crawl around on my hand, and then put him on one of the poles that were near the ice cream place. And, yeah. He's a nice little guy. Heck. <laughs> <laughs> Are you okay? Bro, it's just a little spider. It's not that bad. Spiders aren't that big of a deal. Mortar. <laughs> I like spiders, man. 
We were at Optijack's uh, house wow, yesterday. Wow, why are you and... letting me get gangbanged by three stink <laughs> bugs right now? I'm not fighting that shit. We have no reason to fight them. So I just kept running. Resources. We don't need those resources. Might. Lele Noodle Stream is being mean to me? How am I being mean to you? I am not being mean. I'm just saying spiders are friends. He's fine. Matt got it. Sorry, Lele's making me drink, so... Have fun with your gangbang. <laughs> uh, spiders are friends. Anyways, I was at Optijack's house yesterday, and uh, there was a uh, golden orb weaver. They're probably my favorite spider. The females are fucking huge, and both the males and females have a really pretty like black and gold pattern on their back looks almost like uh almost like a skull on their back they're really pretty i like them and there was a a little tiny baby one and then what we believe to be a male based off of its size kind of chilling near each other bro how are you so far behind what are you doing i was drawing you were drawing? <laughs> the fuck? No, that just sketch. <laughs> this guy. This is the same guy that was like, "We're beating this game today. I don't care. I want to start playing Mass Effect or yeah, Mass Effect we'll Baldur's Gate." Until like eight like, in the morning. <laughs> Both of us work tomorrow. Yeah. Okay. It's fine. Oh, dude. Like, yeah. like, no, fuck it. In the middle of yawning. I don't need sleep. It's fine. <laughs> Jesus Christ, dude. Oh, shit. Back up we go. We should really build a small bed up here somewhere. Just so we can, like, pass the days a little bit more easily. You caught an orb weaver once? I thought about it. Because Noodle and I years ago had one in our uh, backyard, or on our back porch, rather. So I thought about trying to catch it, but I was just going to let it live outside and then, like, you know, go and see it every once in a while. But it fucking disappeared, dude. Like, right after we saw it, it was just never to be seen again. It's never got the chance to, but they're really pretty, and yeah. Birds. <laughs> Are you talking about feeding it birds, or birds got to it? Because this was a female, man. I would like to see the battle between a bird and this thing. I mean, if it was like a big bird, I guess, but like <laughs> it was the size of a small bird, so. <laughs> now, the big ones, though, they can, like, they do sometimes hunt down lizards and small birds and shit like that, which is insane. Fuck you guys. Ow. I mean, this is probably what bottled water is. Where are you? Oh, okay. You're not that far away. The orange orb weaver was tiny like a gumball? Really? I don't think I've ever seen an or orange orb weaver before. This was a uh, golden orb weaver. I don't know if orb weaver is technically the right name for it or not, but... Oh, shit. Hey, you still there, my guy? Yeah. No, you just de de DC'd. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was making sure your internet didn't, like, die or something. Okay. Well, I need to put a thingy down then, because you DC'd. So we go in here. Yeah, if Noodle didn't hate spiders so much, I'd love to have a couple, though. Not a huge fan of, like, the super venomous, venomous ones. Because, you know, I ain't looking to deal with all of that, but... <laughs> Like the the jumping spiders and shit though, I think would be cool to have. 
generally not harmful to humans. They act more like small mammals than they do bugs. Yeah, the dancing jumping spiders, they're just super cute. That's why I like those ones so much. They have fancy butts. <laughs> yes. Yep. <laughs> they sure do. <laughs> Got some fancy butts. That's a toenail. No shit. Okay, yeah, that's... Bunch of shrooms. That's so much fun. Oh! This is the one that I spent forever searching for. The one that was supposed to be in an open pipe with the black ox beetle guarding it. Oh, I need a level three. But it was in oh, the... I have a level two. The wiki said it was, like, on the other side, though, and it's not. There we go. So that should be all five, dude. Oh, those? Yeah. The fancy men? Yeah, the fancy men. Wait, which ones are you talking about? The water droplet hats or the fancy butt ones? It's a huge variety of spiders. I have no idea which ones you're talking about. Fancy butt. Okay. I want to see the orange orb weavers. Oh, wait. No, no. Chocobo said, are they the ones? Well, I still want to see orange orb weavers, though. Those sound cool. I don't think so these ones... what's this boss supposed to be? I don't know. I know nothing about it other than the fact that it exists. Ow. Where are you? I fell. I forgot it was left. Oh, shift. you're there. I thought it was control. <laughs> I was looking at your marker trying to find you. I'm like, where the hell is this dude? Where's the mosquito repellent when you need it? I think jumping spiders in general wear water drops. Dude, that's so fucking cute. Like, how can you not like jumping spiders? They're the cutest things in existence, dude. I really don't give a That's shit, Wendell. <laughs> you just want him to devour your Billy Hog. Yeah, exactly. I'm getting real strong Planescape vibes right now. Peacock, yeah. Talking Peacock spiders. Me. <laughs> a creepy ass looking talking head at that. Honestly, the, yeah. this uh, talking head's more creepy looking than the one in fucking Planescape. Yeah, at least That's... he's just a skull that wants to get yeah. laid. Yeah. I think right. Wendell wants to get laid as well. All that Billy Hog talk. I was buying a prostitute and he tried to convince me to buy him one. <laughs> Don't give me too many spoilers. I haven't gotten that far into Planescape to the Tournament. Torment. I do plan on playing it eventually. I'm torn right now if I want to play, like, Pillars of Eternity or if I want to play Planescape first, though. I feel like I would get... It would be hard for me to switch back and forth on rule sets and shit. I don't... I don't know. I don't really see it as a problem, personally. Oh, man. Especially because Planescape is so light on rules. I think Pillars is relatively light, too. Because it doesn't use, like, D&D. It uses its own shit. What am I being chased by? Oh, an orc's ant. Fuck that orc ant. Marbled Orb Weaver is the real name? I'll have to look that up. Actually, I will as soon as I get in the house and go to bed. Wait, hold on. So I very cozy. I hear Calm raw science. Oh no, my god, dude. What do we need raw science for? <laughs> I hear it. I want it. Marble I don't know where it's at. Orb Come Weaver. On. They got a fat butt on them, don't they? Holy shit, dude. That's like a brain on their back. What the hell? I gotta look this thing up. Hold on. <laughs> they have a similar uh, golden pattern on their butt, though, that the golden orb weaver does. 
That's pretty wicked looking, dude. But like that gold pattern that they have, that's very similar to what the golden orb gold wheelers Lord. get on them. She thick. Golden. Yeah, dude, she got an ass on her, let me tell you. It looks almost like a tick. Like, <laughs> uh, a female golden orb weaver. Are also known as pumpkin spiders. So it's the females that have the inflated butts. I mean, that makes one. sense. Yeah. Golden silk orb weaver. Ours wasn't quite that big. I was trying to find one akin to like the one we saw behind our house, but I'm not seeing a good one. Wasn't the banded one? I don't know. Anyways, it was some kind of orb weaver, golden orb weaver. There's different kinds and shit. Makes it confusing, but better head to bed, guys. I got to rest tomorrow so I can help with our Pride Festival on Sunday. I hope that goes well, dude. Have a good night. Thank you for coming and hanging out, dude. Jesus Christ, man! <laughs> I just noticed all of the mounts all over the place. Yeah, clicky on one. Why does, uh, what does the cozy do for us? Yeah, that does, like, shake the screen and shit. Oh, well, let's check. Inventory. Uh, down here. Coziness hunger rate. Slows your hunger drain. Thirst yeah, okay. drain. That's what uh, I figured. All day bonus to hunger fullness. Thirst saturation. Okay. So what I figured it did. Just drink and mm. eat less. Which, I mean, isn't a bad thing. Grab some food. Uh, can we cook any more food, actually? Uh, just the ant lion shit. Okay. Just take some food out of here, then. This one's about to go first. I'll so what you one. saw is... Hmm. Hold on. I'm going through them. That's interesting. I'm looking at spiders in our area uh, oh, you gotta remember though you can't 100% go off the area map because animals don't respect boundaries <laughs> they yeah, just go true. wherever the fuck they want this looks similar to what we saw at the house i feel like oh i, I just copied the name i lost the it's, barrier uh, there. fuck the berry leather go uh they're called there it is garden black and yellow garden spiders also known as a golden garter uh garden spider black and yellow garden spider yeah, okay. Yeah. Uh, Is that what you had? Yeah. But a female one, not the male one that... Oh, no. It couldn't have been if the length is only an inch. Oh. Female black and yellow garden spiders are much larger than males. Typically, the length for females, not counting legs, is one inch. This thing was a lot bigger than one inch, its body. Was it not a golden orb weaver? It looked like that, but it was a lot bigger than one inch, dude. <laughs> like, How long do you think it was? Uh, Just body from like head to end of ass, probably about two and a half, three inches. Estimating, it's been years. From tip of head to end of the body. And then the legs expanded out much farther than that. I didn't realize we had so many 
different types of spiders around here. Fishing spiders. They're the large, some of the largest spiders in our state. Yeah, it wasn't a golden orb weaver though, which is what I tend to call it, because <laughs> that's definitely a different spider. Yeah, I don't fucking know. Golden silk orb weaver. No, that's more like spotted. Was an orchid orb weaver? Orchid. Orb. Oh, we also have banded garden spiders as well. It could have been an orchid orb weaver. I don't remember the legs being green. It did have a fat butt on it. And like I said, it was long. And it had that skull-like golden black pattern on its back. Said banded? Banded yeah. garden spider? What the fuck is that? I'm trying to see no. what their lengths. Ah, uh, they're small, 15 to 25 millimeters. I don't know. Maybe it was just an abnormally large fucking <laughs> one. I don't know. Or I wonder, maybe it was pregnant. Maybe during pregnancy they get bigger? Or no, because don't spiders usually carry their egg sacs, not have them internally? Yeah. So Thank probably you. not that then. I don't fucking know, That's dude. Interesting. I know it definitely wasn't an inch. I know it was bigger than an inch for sure. Its body. We also have European garden spiders. They're not Heck. as yellow, though. Because that's just... That's an inch right there. Like, it was bigger than that. For sure. Was it yellow for sure? It, the pattern on its back was. It was, like, golden yellow. I can't remember exactly what color the legs were. Yeah, actually, like, looking at it, I pulled out my calipers. <laughs> actually looking at size, I would say probably about a half inch smaller than I thought. About two to two and a half inches. Instead of two and a half to three inches for the body. And then the legs sprawled out real fucking far. But whatever, I'm making this a beginning thing. Argyop. The fuck? I don't know how to pronounce that. Black and yellow, A-R-G-I. So it looks like that, yeah. Is, is it the right size, though? Female size. See, that's the one that's three quarters to one inch, though. Does that count the head? Common names, yellow garden spider, zipper spider... Habitats and has life cycle, citations. Like I said, maybe it was just an abnormally large one. But like twice the size doesn't sound reasonable. Maximum size for a female is about 15 millimeters. No, no, that's... Bro, that's 15 millimeters. <laughs> that's the, the width of my finger. <laughs> this thing... <laughs> this thing was a hell of a lot bigger than the width of my finger. Spiders measure by body length. They're the largest spiders most people in the USA will encounter. Is it 15 millimeters wide? <laughs> Uh, oh, hey, I don't think they're counting legs. Well, no, they're not at... counting legs, but just okay. the body, according to the site I was just looking at, just the body is the width of my finger. That's nothing, dude. <laughs> That's like between the width of my finger to about two fingers wide is like the range that they're saying. Because I was looking at wolf spiders, and they were saying that they were only an inch long, and I was like, uh, bro, the ones I killed in my room were, like, the size of my hand. 
I wonder, though, if body length counts the head. I mean, the head is only, you know, like one-fifth of its whole size, but that would add a little yeah, bit Yeah, because, like, I'm looking at the uh, female wolf spider, and they're saying that they, they only go up to 25 millimeters. There ain't no way. Female average. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Whatever. That I'm pretty. We have just been very, very wrong. Some, <laughs> some big ass extremely. spiders. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but pattern wise and everything, yeah, it's the black and yellow argiope, which I I have to, or however the hell you pronounce it, I have to assume that's what it was though, because it looks exactly the same as that. I'm just certain it was bigger than one inch long, like from head to tail. Oh shit, I forgot to actually make the thing. I got distracted by spiders. Alright, and beginning cocktail. Uh, why can't I craft it? Hot craft of it. Uh, yeah, I mean, we were close, but like, I don't know, man. We have everything. Why can't we. You have to use it. the workbench. I'm using the workbench. Oh, do you have to take it? Do you have to... Raft? Materials with nearby and storage? Do you have the grilled science? Yeah. Well, oh, it's in the... It's just, yeah. Yeah, it's in the thing. Requires plant fiber. Doesn't it usually say... Okay, requires workbench, that says. This one doesn't say shit. Oh, don't use the workbench then. Well, you can make everything that you can make in the workbench that you can't make in the workbench. Whatever. Point is, <laughs> if you don't need a workbench, you can still use a workbench, but it doesn't work outside of the workbench either. Maybe, where's Wendell? Oh, you have to place it where the game tells you, so you can't. Oh, you actually have to take it with you? Yeah, okay. you have to, and yeah, you have to brew it, I guess, at that wherever okay. you got the quest from. Okay, that's fine. We can do that. Uh, but we need to find the grilled science. I think it's just with us. Oh, uh, like it's just attached to us? <laughs> I, I think. Hold on. Let me see if, if I leave. If it still says I have 101. I don't know oh, trash can. I go. Interesting. Yeah, it still says I have one of one. Okay. So probably just a part of us now. That's fine then. I'm gonna grab do I, do I still have extra food? No, I must have ate it at some point. Grab extra food and I'm heading out then. To where we just were, basically. I mean, it was years ago. It's perfectly possible I'm just misremembering how big it was, but I don't know, man. Like, and from what we were just reading on the web, like you said, not only do I think I've seen wolf spiders bigger than 0.2 or 225 millimeters, um, but it says the... See, they look exactly like these things, honestly. <laughs> like, these are the spiders that I had outside my house, <laughs> these orb weavers. <laughs> That's <laughs> they looked exactly the same, just you know, the size of the big ones. Anyways, point is, um from the the websites we were reading, it says that the uh black and yellow whatever is only three millimeters larger than wolf spiders. And it looked a fair bit larger than a wolf spider to me, but I don't fucking are know. They like, uh, are they like uh crazy? Are they like a type of animal where the older they get, they just keep growing? Maybe I don't know. Because according I know to you, that thing hung around a long ass time. Maybe it's old as shit. <laughs> it uh, I mean, I know spiders. I don't know if they all do, but I know a lot of spiders shed. Yeah, like so their exoskeletons. So yeah, I'm assuming you might have just had just like a forever. state record spider in your backyard. <laughs> I mean, that thing disappeared and never showed up again, so I don't know. Probably got a house and fucking... <laughs> job and... Retired, just started relaxing, yeah. sent the kids out to get all the food Probably for like, them. 
the golf like, club club down the road <laughs> or some shit. <laughs> oh, Maybe fuck. join the nudist club. <laughs> yeah, oh, there we go, dude. Alright, some biggin' and cocktails. So I'm assuming we activate the machine, go fight the secret boss, and then come back. Where's the secret boss? We think it's in that head. Where we found the other lab at. I hope. But we couldn't get into it. Boy, I'm assuming how the hell did you get up this? You go up the rock. I'm no, trying just keep to go run, just rock. keep running. And then you oh, jump to your left right there, yeah. How many times have we come up here? How do you not know this by now, Once. dude? <laughs> We've oh my god. You're literally the one that found this path. <laughs> <laughs> come up at once it's like years ago feels like it sometimes i like this game but it has dragged on too long I mean, if we would have actually sat and played it like normal it probably wouldn't have been as bad i don't know we played an average of like two and a half hours per session yeah but we used to play games like eight hours a night bro uh, yeah when you didn't have a job and i didn't sleep oh you son of a bitch <laughs> knocked me off there there we go. Then we normally spend our first hour trying to get our bearings. I mean, that's only an hour, though. We've been playing... Just on stream, we played for, like, 28 hours or something like that. That's not counting the eight hours or so that we played before we started streaming. Played eight hours? Roughly. I mean, we built that whole house. Before we started streaming it. Ow. Good homes? Yeah, I might. But you know what? I'm going to kill you for attacking me. <laughs> Since we're up here anyways, I'm going to see if there's toenails back yet. Just because I'm curious at this point. They gotta respawn at some point, man. I refuse to believe otherwise. Ah, <clears throat> uh, bro, we should have brought the shit to build zip lines. Mm. We could have made this a hell of a lot easier on ourselves. Oh, well. Live and let live, I suppose, right? Something like that. Bro, you fell way behind. Damn. Fighting. Every time I look over, I see that ham sandwich, and it got me feeling some sort of way. <laughs> the fuck? What the hell's that got to do with killing some ants or whatever you're fighting? Because. It's distracting me. This is crazy. Why don't you come jump on this battery real quick? No. That I should... learned my lesson. <laughs> I think that'll straighten you up real quick. Might get me excited. <laughs> the promise of an instant shocking death. Hell yeah. Let's just call off tomorrow, broski. I wish, dude. Look, if I didn't have to work, I wouldn't, but got bills and shit. What the PPTO's for? Where did you go? Oh. Yeah, I'm checking to see if the toenails are back yet. Oh, son of a bitch, jumped right over that. Nope, still not back yet. Okay, guess it's a good thing we found that one. What's that door lead to? What door? Oh, wait, there's raw science. Can get your job. I can't talk, dude. Your shower, enjoy. That's what I was trying to say. Everything looks good from here. That's good, Wendell. I'm glad you have that one 
generic voice line you say constantly. <laughs> <laughs> your jower, yeah. Enjoy your jower, my love. But just because I know you watch him, uh, Chocobo, I've been watching uh, 4-8 Productions play the hardcore Final Fantasy VII run that he started like seven years ago or something like that. I haven't gotten that far in it, but to be fair, neither has he at the point I'm in. I've watched like eight videos of it, and he's only gotten like 20 minutes into the game. <laughs> like, the game's fucking... Oof, that mod, man. Terrible. But it looks interesting. I'm tempted to try it. I'm wondering if there's been any, any updates, though, to fix some of the issues. It's brutal. Yeah, I, like I said, from what I've seen so far, yeah, definitely. I can only imagine how it's going to be in the future. Can we get up this way? Yes. Okay, then we need to get up there. I don't really remember how to get up there, up there. Can we go in here? Is this unlocked? Is that gonna kill you? Touch what? that. That outlet. What outlet? It's sparking. Oh. This one. Because you could probably hop up on. Oh. <laughs> or just don't. It's fine. Like... It's safe. Okay. Well, you have fun with that. So it's locked, but if I put on the assistant manager key card, will it unlock the entomologist badge or whatever? No. It's still locked. Wait. I'm coming, I'm coming. Oh, I'm beginning, so this is how you activate it. You hit the on button right here. Well, yeah, no, I know how to activate it. I've turned it on before. It's just, it said, like, we didn't have the necessary stuff or whatever to do it, so. Oh, shit, there's a zip line, like, right back there. That would have been so much easier than what we're doing. I'm also going to drop a save real quick before we throw this shit in. Uh, just in case this actually triggers, like, the end game. Create new save. So we do want to try and get the bad, uh, the good ending, rather. Is that a new save? 227? Yep, okay. Insufficient are you, power. Are you fucking kidding me? Okay. Maybe we have to go over here first and put the shit in. Then how do we get the power? The embiggening cell is in place. We're okay. almost ready to commence brewing. Oh, there's the circuit the up here. Pencil sharpener? Where the fuck is the pencil sharpener? The pencil sharpener up there? No. Not that I see. You sure? Because it's saying to go up there. <laughs> How did you get up there? Oh, the whole thing is a pencil sharpener. sharpener. What? It's one of those, like, automatic ones. I thought we, this was I a have coffee one pot, of these. dude. I have this exact pencil sharpener. Are you sure? It looks like a fucking coffee mom pot to it. me, dude. No, up here, mom gave <laughs> oh, me it. Oh, up there. Well, it's I haven't like, been yeah, up there. Yeah, it's like from the 80s. I haven't been up there yet. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. I see what you're talking about. Just oh. Throw it in there? Really shove yeah. it. Yeah. Wasn't that shit. Okay. Switch on the Java Matic. Oh shit, I don't have my. Okay. Well, that hurt. <laughs> but I'm not dead. <laughs> I forgot I switched out the fucking Dandelion Tough for that badge. Oh shit, dude. Oh, okay. It's doing something. Okay, I'm getting the insufficient power message, though. Me too. Oh, God. Yes. Like there are still a few bugs left 
Repair the mixer modules. Okay. We need to get down there and repair those mixer modules. We can do that. That's not too bad. I am about to die Watch though. Need a shit ton of resources. I don't have a death wish. Does it? Does it take shit? I don't know. It's gooing. It's oozing. It's gooing. <laughs> oh, they have health. It's health at zero though. Oh, okay. So I can probably just use my repair tool to fix them. Which thankfully I do have. Yep. Okay, one's fixed. Did you kill the bug on this one? Yeah, these ones are fine. That one's oh, fixed. Oh, this one got its health back. Yeah, I fixed it. This one, the one that I'm on? Yeah. Oh, there we go. Did you fix this one? Yeah, I fixed all yeah, three. I guess so. Okay. So now we go back up. Speak with Dr. Tolly at the Java Matic. We should go over the brewing process. Look at the state of this. <sighs> Subterfuge, reckless destruct this all reeks. I must warn you. The fusion process for the Ambix end, it will take some time to brew. I'm the orcs. Oh, okay. They'll take down the entire system. A prudent suggestion. Strong enough defensive structure. I have a storage facility not far from here that should be of use. This might take a bit longer to get you home, but safety first. Okay. Pause. Okay. Um. Bro, <laughs> let's see if we can build a bed real quick to get it to daytime. And then I was thinking we just put up a bunch of walls around them. Yep. Like, just super simple fucking defenses and then just fight the shit. What do we need to build a bed here to get it to daytime? Uh, bed. That'd be under furniture. Or a lean to, whatever. Oh my god, you unlock so much useless shit. Where, where's the fucking lean to's at? Oh, it's right here. All right. Uh, clover sprigs. You wanna? Did you pop it down? No. Bro, where? <laughs> where the fuck are you? I was just gonna pop it down here. Like, oh, okay, you're up there. Yeah, anywhere over here is fine with me. Okay, so three clover leaf and one sprig. Well, I got the one sprig. Yeah, me too. What do we have making it so now we just need to find clover leaves. Oh, I found clovers. Thank God. Did you bring any extra food with you? Uh, yeah, one. one okay. thing. Oh, I guess fine. I have a, uh, I have granola bars as well. I don't need any extra. I brought an extra for myself as well. It's just whenever we sleep, we're gonna lose like all of our food and yeah. drink. Sadly. The one downside to sleeping. Where's these right. resources he was talking about? Set Anyone respawn and sleep. I think he said he marked it on the map, so probably just look at the map and find it. Um. Oh, with the Java Matic. Oh, really? Right up top there? Yeah, it's a storage facility. Oh, yeah, okay. back. Yeah, it's not bad at all. You gonna check that out then? Yeah. I'll start placing random walls and shit. 
I'm guessing grass would be the easiest to build. Grass walls. Oh, it's down, I think, actually. Oh, maybe it's that spot that I was trying to get in but couldn't because it was locked. Oh, shit, maybe he just unlocked damage. it. Yeah, it looks like it. Okay. Oh, we got more food, pine cones, uh, pupa hud. Nice. Love me a good pupa, you know? Wooden splinters. Gunpowder clumps. Uh, a shit ton of slop, which heals. Oh, nice, okay. And, yep, they all heal. A uh, bunch of arrows, uh, the specialty arrows. One's a bomb arrow. Uh, we got mushroom bricks, crow feathers, spiky burrs, and lint rope. And I'm almost out of room. We're gonna need a shit ton of um, grass for this, dude. I am out of room. I feel like I could drop a lot of these arrow stacks. Oh, this is gonna take a while. I'm just thinking two layers of walls around each. Oh shit, there's more. More food, muscle sprouts, gum nuggets, and more pine cone pieces. Most of that shit's kind of useless though. Like the gum nuggets and whatnot, we can't build defenses with that. I don't think. I mean, maybe we can. I guess I've never oh, tried a bed before. In here as well. Oh well. <laughs> Too late. Did you set your respawn point? Yeah, okay. not to here, but to the bed outside. Can we use the pine cones for stuff? I have no clue, my guy. The spiky burrs, I, I guess, for defenses. Oh, like you just put them around it and anything that touches them gets hurt, maybe? Yeah. That makes sense. Hydrate? Why don't you hydrate, my guy? When's the last time you hydrated, Lele? Not doing shots. I'm a good Christian boy. I don't drink booze. Oh my god, <laughs> there's so much more. There's so much more? Right. Yeah, you have to come in here and grab this. I'm I'm absolutely filled to the brim. Is, <laughs> do we actually and need any of that stems. shit, though? Yeah. It'll, it's all defensive shit. Most of it doesn't sound like defensive shit, my guy. Most of it sounds kind of useless. All of this is building shit. It's mushroom bricks... Crow feathers. Crow feathers uh, are a building like material? 30 spiky burrs, lint rope, egg corn shells, silk right. rope. But what are we actually going to use that way. shit for? That's the point. All the mushroom like, bricks we can build walls with. Yeah, we can also just use grass, which is right here. Yeah, but the walls are going to be stronger with mushroom bricks. Uh, okay. Well, you build those ones. Yeah. What the fuck? I want to let me build this. Mushrooms are nice. I do like mushrooms. This is, I agree with you on that one. That's not so bad. Tori, eat my food. Have we never made mushroom bricks. I don't think so. Yeah, so I can't even make shit with. Because there's not analyze. There's not an analyzer in there. I don't know. I don't see one. It's big. Jesus Christ! Here, what the hell? What 
the hell was that, dude? Something like blew up. Yeah, no, there's no analyzer. God damn it. Is there a, uh, whatchamacallit around here? A hut? Science hut? Ants deserve to know. die as well. I find ants to just kind of be, like, annoying. Other than that, they're not, like, that big of a deal. I say, or, I mean, I don't know what this final attack's gonna be like. But I think we'll be fine with a couple layers of grass walls, dude. Oh, wait. Yeah, it's, oh, you're talking about the field stations. Yeah. They constantly invade your home, same. That's the one bug that Noodle and I have problems with at the house. Like, we don't get that many spiders in the house. We, we do get millipedes every once in a while, or whatever. Centipedes, things. whatever the fuck they're called. We get them every once in a while, but not a ton of them. Flies and gnats aren't too bad, but we do get ants every fucking year that we gotta deal with. It's annoying. Oh, there's a science hut over here. Analyze all this extra shit that I just got. Oh, it's because Wendell's fucking in it. God, dude, Wendell's annoying as shit. <laughs> Glad he follows you and not me. We have to put down traps and call the ant murderer, dude. <laughs> we don't call ant murderer dudes, but we do put down traps. He's inside the wall that I'm trying to build, so I literally can't build. I think he's glitched inside of it. Like, I don't think he can even get out of it. What's on your mind? Uh. God damn it, dude. Okay. Cancel this one, I guess. Put him over here. Oh, you can make burr explosive burr trap. Wendell, get the fuck out of my wall, dude. I can make uh, wasp shit now. Oh my god. <laughs> Fucking hate Wendell. Twice a year. And spring hits and when it turns to fall. Yeah, we get them in the spring. I don't think we really get them in the fall that bad. Not that I can remember, at least. But we do definitely get them every spring. We, uh... Kind of got a second wave of them this time. Because normally, we just have a problem with them downstairs. Like, you know, around the kitchen, bathroom area of our house. But this year, some of them got upstairs somehow. Not in, like, the bedroom or anything, but where uh, we feed the cats. Or one of the cats. Apparently they grew a taste for cat food or something. Alright, well, I got the defenses on one side of one done. Working on the other side now. <laughs> Puts down this gel that ants go crazy over and then they commit mass homicide with it. I like it. As it should be. I think that that's basically what's, what's in the mind? traps, right? Can I, like, make you... Yeah, stay. Stop moving. <clears throat> I've never had them really mess with the cat food before. Not that I can think of, at least. But... They were going crazy over it this time. A uh, less intense version of the same thing. That makes sense, I guess. Because the less intense shit would probably be less likely to, like, cause harm to humans. <laughs> so, <laughs> they sell it in stores. You know what I should be doing, actually? Here, drop all this shit. I'm going to sit over here in my little hidey hole. And then... I'm just going to use the fucking gnat, dude. <laughs> now that I've cut down a bunch of this shit. 
What is it? G. Come here, little nap, buddy. This wave they got into your upstairs bathroom? <laughs> question mark, question mark, question mark. And then your front room. Yeah, they're uh they're brutal this year, man. I feel like this is the the most we've ever gotten, but we had some traps left over from like last year or the year before or something though, so we just put those down and haven't really had a problem with them since, thankfully. Took a few days, but yeah, that's what for us it usually is too, is our kitchen slash uh bathroom. But our kitchen and bathroom are right next to each other, so it makes some sense. That they hang out in those areas. Right, yeah, this is so much quicker. Are you still alive, my guy? Yeah, I'm building. Oh, are you? I didn't yeah. see you over here anywhere. Oh, I see. I see your mushroom bricks over there. My kingdom. Your kingdom. <laughs> Something like that. Oh shit, that's not what I meant to do. Whatever. Where's like the traps and shit located? I don't know, I've never... Explosive burr trap. Oh, I need fungal growth for that. Spike traps. Plank pallets. Oh shit. Usually to check Reddit? What? <laughs> Why? Why do I need to check Reddit? Which... Which sub? I don't even... <laughs> Just saying check Reddit doesn't help me out much, guy. Check what on Reddit? Ah, oh, for the traps. Ha 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 ha. That's where you can find your traps, Lele said. Oh, goodness. On Reddit. <laughs> I don't know why, though. She's a trap. All right, my defenses are done. Double layer walls. Hold on, I gotta go back and grab more mushrooms. On that one. You got like a maze going over here, bro. Bro, I got a ant that followed me inside. <laughs> Get off there. There we go. Oh my god, that was dumb of me. The bricks look cooler. Oh, they definitely look better. And I'm sure they are more defensive as well, don't get me wrong. But I feel like if we were both doing this, we would just be done with it already. And that was my thing, was just trying to get done with the shit sooner. I just dropped like 500 crow feathers in the thing. Instead yeah. of trashing them. So don't go in there, it'll drop your <laughs> FPS. Alright. Build this shit. Do you have to, like, open a door to get in there or anything? No. Then just use the gnat, dude. It's so much quicker. I guess you actually have to craft your bricks, though, huh? No, they're crafted. Oh, okay. Yeah, just use the gnat, dude. Bro, you That's don't even technically have cheating, but... a roof. The insects can just go up Fly? here. Fly? Yeah, it's fine. I can put a roof on it if I want to. What if it's, like, a wasp? Like I said, I can put a roof on it. And this, there's still another one, don't forget. I thought you were doing that one. There's Bro, I'm not going to have enough mushrooms. <laughs> Everything looks good from here. Well, all we need is a bunch more grass cut. How do you, I'll activate. There we go. Yeah. I'm just going to spend the next couple years cutting grass. Alright, exit the handy net. 
I was using it as cover so I'd stop getting attacked by ants. That's why I didn't put a roof on it yet. I mean, I guess if I was just standing on it, the ants wouldn't be able to get me either, but whatever. Do I have to build it up too high? Um. Where's the roof at? Alright, kill this fucking ant. It's being annoying. Where is it? Pretty sure that's your limit for the day. So sorry. <laughs> Rude. <laughs> the fuck? Random caps lock there, my guy. Ow. I'm getting crushed by fucking grass. Guess I should stop trying to fuck grass. Haha. -ha. Wait, are the floors what you have to use as a roof? Yeah. Oh, so you can only make grass floors. Oh, you can make burr floors. You can also make uh clay foundations or whatever. Which I haven't tried to use as a roof before, but I imagine it would work. Cutting down the entire forest over here. Don't mind me. Okay, this probably isn't going to be enough, but I'm going to imagine that it is. Pretend that it is. Get my gnat friend back. Damn it, I can't jump over this one. Yeah, whatever. This is protected enough. Or no, it's not. Son of a bitch. Go away, you fucking ants, dude. You're glitched inside the fucking power cord. How's that fair? Fucking bastards. Okay. Build. Nat. Speedy boy, let's go. Very full. Watch the attack be like nothing, dude, and we didn't even need the fucking grass. <laughs> or any of the defenses, rather. Oh, I can still attack it right here. Um... Oh, you built it too small? Don't you hate when it's too small? Then add a skewed even though you fucking hate them IRL. It's super handy too. <laughs> I love this fucking net. They do suck IRL though. 100% dude. Thankfully they're not that hard to deal with though. It's just like make sure any fruit and shit's picked up and put out a strip or two. One of the glue strips. Or, I mean, you can just strip. That might scare them away. I don't know. <laughs> Never tried stripping for a nap before. <laughs> How's that rude? I don't know what I said wrong there. Oh, I didn't mean like you specifically stripping would scare them away. <laughs> Oh, God. I'm assuming that's what you're calling rude. My bad, B. Is 
do your bricks look nice and all, dude? But I have two double walls almost complete. I only need three I think more the planks. Mushroom walls are the strongest. I'm sure they are stronger, but again, like, is it gonna be necessary? I feel like it's probably just overkill. Or we at the end game? We don't know. I can assume nothing. The last two bosses we fought were nothing, though. I think the worst part about this is that it's just going to be annoying. I could a Noodle, five bits, thank you. All right, time to start roofing. Yeah, I couldn't fully roof mine. That's... We're just going to have to deal with that. I got three of them <laughs> directly <laughs> over it. Oh shit. Uh cancel that one, cancel that one. Try again. Honestly, I say we just start it and see how it goes. We might not need a roof. I think we should put the roofs on first. Oh shit. I'm gonna need grass planks. I was gonna say, yeah, if you just cut a bunch of grass planks, I can do this part of it. So there's that one. I'll go do your roof now. What kind of roof is this? Uh, it's made out of those burrs. Oh. Oh, so it's not like a... Man, I was hoping it would, like, stab you or something, you know? Nah. Shit. They do have a defensive... Uh, they explode, but we need some sort of other thing for that. Your shit is yeah. offset, dude. It's not... Yeah, I know. <laughs> it's fucking... Jesus Christ. Okay. Um... Five. Oh, maybe I should grab that perk right now. Or just use the gnat. They can carry like 20. I didn't know that. Good lord. It's uh, not literally 20, I don't think, but it's a lot. That's <laughs> why so I was saying if you just cut them, I can fly back and forth and. Oh, you're fine? Okay. Yeah. Well, here, I'll drop these then. BRB, we're gonna go throw these ones down. Noodle, he's being mean. How am I being mean? I didn't say shit this time. I legit don't think I did anything wrong. I'm actually going to count this time how many it is. <laughs> 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 16, 20, 24, 25 is how many the Gnat can carry. I'm like deforesting this. Entire I know, dude. <laughs> Same. I know you can see how many are available, but if there's any too close to where you're building, they'll be added to that total. That's why I wanted to count it out. Because there's like a uh, buildable area of effect around you where it'll just grab the resources for you. Actually a very handy feature, but I didn't I know if like any of these were grass. too close. No. It's not? I still have half of my roof on one to build, a little bit on yours to build, and then an entire another roof to do. I probably got like hundreds of grass things over here. <laughs> well, each one, each roof section takes four grass. Oh, what? The handy got soaked? I must have accidentally dipped them in water or something. Oh, whatever. I need to move anyways. Hopefully I don't get attacked. Okay. I mean, it might be enough at this point, dude. I don't know. You can help build if you want. I don't care. Okay, floors. Why are you not snapping to the top of any of these things? 
by after shower things, I want to point out what she means is she was sitting in the tub or on the side of the tub or the toilet. That's it. That's <laughs> that's what her after shower things are. She's just spending an hour sitting next to the tub. I don't fucking get it. Bruh, for some reason it won't let me build. I might need you. <laughs> it won't let me build on top of these grass sections. These grass walls that I built for some reason. What? Grass floor. It, it'll only snap to the middle. Like, see how the other ones are snapped to the top? Hmm. Over here? Or, oh, no, they're all snapped to one. The grass walls, it doesn't actually go to the top. I see. That's annoying. All right, get Mr. Natty Boy out again. Got to build a couple extra walls, I guess. As support structures. That should be enough over here. Oh wait, no, not like that. God damn it. Like that. Like that. There we go. It's a few support structures. I canceled the wrong one because I'm a f fucking idiot. There we go. I guess I should add some support structures to yours as well over here. Does he have a light? He does. Thank God. Oh, that's nice. It's not very bright, though. I don't get the sitting on the side of the tub thing, dude. To dry off. I just use a towel and then go about my day. <laughs> Each their own. Like, it's not hurting nobody. I just don't, I don't get it. Um, you good, homie? Yeah. <laughs> Your Nat's just like running up against a wall over oh, here. Oh, <laughs> yeah. I'm looking at something. Ah, oh, that's not going to be tall enough. Son of a bitch. Whatever. It's not going to be perfect, but it's good enough for me. Beautiful. <laughs> Gotta air dry? Why, though? Like, why not just dry off like a normal person with a towel and then go about your life? That's the point. That's the part I don't understand. Like, use the... Yeah, but you can do that just, like, living your life instead of just sitting on the side of the tub, you know what I mean? Like, go play a game or watch a show or a movie or... I don't know. Whatever. Bro, I think we've gone through all of your shit. Oh, no, there's a little bit more over here. What are you looking up, anyways? Ban, or bans for my friend. Oh. <laughs> it's random as shit, okay. He fucking kills me. Tub is a safe space. Don't judge. Why are you being so judgmental? I'm not being judgmental. I'm just saying I don't get it. I literally said y'all can do whatever the hell you want. It's your life. It's not hurting anybody. But yeah, I ain't gonna sit here and lie, though. I don't understand it. Try it, then you'll understand. It sounds like too much of a waste of time, dude. To try. 
Like, I ain't got that kind of time to just sit on the edge of a tub for an hour or two. It's one of the many reasons I don't really care for baths. I'm a shower guy. Baths just take too long. Alright, legit. I mean, it's nighttime, so I can't tell for sure. But I think I've used all of your grass besides, like, ten. Thankfully, that's almost everything, if not everything. Plus, you have some in your hands. Still. Oh, shit. One sec. No, you're fine. I'm not trying to rush you. I'm just saying it. I think we have just enough. That's all I'm saying. It's on the toilet for 30 minutes, sometimes longer. I do take 20. It's usually 20 minutes. It's very rare that it's more than 20 to 30 minutes. But yeah, I take long shits. I ain't afraid to admit it. <laughs> I have two times a day I get to relax, right? Right before bed and when I'm taking a shit. So yeah, <laughs> I'm going to spend 20 minutes relaxing while I'm taking a shit. I need one more. One more. But I think I think it's done. I'm gonna say that's good enough. We'll drop a save, but This looks like shit, but <laughs> it looks guarded to me. So you're a hypocrite? I don't know, man. Am I? You can call me one, it doesn't really bother me. My bass are one to three hours long. That's what I'm saying, though. Like, that's way too fucking long, dude. Wait, what? I don't, I don't have three hours. One yeah, three exactly. Hours, yeah. Though? I don't even... Literally, I only have about four free hours in a day. I'm not going to spend three of that <laughs> fucking in a bathtub, dude. I mean, if I was fucking in a bathtub, maybe, but... <laughs> Bro, why I got. not let me build in that wall? All those walls should be done. Oh, it's not showing done for me. It's showing oh. them as blueprints there, still. There should be one piece on yours that still needs done. That's it. Uh, top portion. Yeah. I always grab like a glass of wine, phone, book, switch, tablet for entertainment, scroll TikTok. I can't fucking scroll TikTok for that long either, dude. I'd rather off myself. But <laughs> just straight up relaxing. I'm all for some relaxing time. But I don't have that time, dude. Literally just do not have that time. Alright, we sleeping? We're gonna be hungry, though. Oh, you said you got some uh, extra food, right? Maybe. Yeah, I have extra food. Okay, good. Let's fucking sleep. Hey, I'm gonna fall asleep and then start this bitch, then. Also, bath bombs. Like I said, it's your guys' lives. I ain't, I ain't, you know, icking your yums or whatever. I just, I don't Excuse have the time for that me? sort of shit. Icking your yums? It's usually, like, for kinks and shit like that, you know? Don't ick my yums. Mm. Anyways, I need food. <laughs> What's that so bad? Oh, hey, do you want some of these? I'm a what? Beefy slop. Man. Is that food? I don't know what the hell it is. Uh, nope. It's not food. <laughs> what the fuck is it? How do I split a stack? Oh, it's just... It's just, uh... Recovery, so I just wasted one. Uh... I don't remember. Hold on. Is it right-click? Oh, you can drop one at a time if you right-click. Nice, okay. Come on, bro, it's three o'clock. Let's go. Just like a food pound. So it's everything. I'm just eating. Where's the food? You didn't drop me any food. I don't have food for you. I had extra food for myself. Bro, I literally asked, Do you have extra food? And you said, uh yeah. I think there's some and I said, in there. Because I don't on. have any. Eat those. Jesus Christ. We don't need a shit ton, just enough so we don't like lose half our stamina. Yeah, like, that's enough. You can have that last one. 
I don't need it. Oh, fuck, it is. I'm going to crash. <laughs> Have a good night, nude, or Lele, whatever the fuck your name is. Do you work tomorrow? I think you work on Saturdays normally, right? Anyways, have a good night. Probably see you tomorrow. Oh my God. Sadly. Probably. I feel that. I feel that. Let's call off. I feel it. Three to ten? You want to trade? I wouldn't mind an extra two hours of sleep in the morning. This week has been awful. Um, bro, you started it? Yeah, started it. Oh my god, it's like domination. We have letters. <laughs> Brewing, brewing. God, this goes up super fucking slow. Okay, it went up a chunk. Oh, I'm glad we put I hear brews. a bug. Yeah, it's you know what wasp. we didn't put, though? A way up. They're pulling, 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 oh, okay, pulling, they're just pulling. on the side over here, though. Oh, God. Let's go, man. It's too tight of a fit. Okay. Oh we shit! Dealt with. There's more though. They're at every base right now. Oh, I guess we should probably like ants. split it up. Yeah, I'm gonna head over to. Uh... Oh shit! They're back on. Two times fights almost broke out. That's awesome, dude. She's taking a beating. You got it. I believe in you. Fucking firefly, dude. There's a big insect incoming. Wait, what? Willow just said there's a big insect incoming. What the hell is this? A oh, bombardier beetle? Oh my god, hold on. I gotta switch over to my bombs. This is bad. They're breaking shit. Oh shit, you just drop it at your feet? Yeah. <laughs> Or no, you should be able to throw it. Uh, it didn't happen. Uh, yeah, um... Stretch? Need, I cannot need, stretch right now. <laughs> I will as soon as I get a second. Alright, well, as soon as A is clear, I'll be over. Oh, man, just spawned. C's there you go, you got your help. Down. A what? Large orc? A large a orc. orc ladybird. They're, these things are called orcs, remember? Yeah. The ones that's that are being I mean, controlled. Like, what was it? It's a ladybird. It's just a ladybug. Right? Yeah, it's a bird. So it's going to take a while, man, for me to deal with this one. I can deal with it on my own, but, uh. But yeah, <laughs> you're going to have to defend everything else while I am. <laughs> A's not looking incredibly hot either. Yeah, there's like mosquitoes and shit over at A. Going to A. Oh shit, yeah, A is not looking great. These bombs, bombs, bomb arrows. Bomb arrows are doing like nothing. Oh, my, my mat just destroyed the firefly, though. <laughs> Bro, this Bro, fucking I'm sucks. So much, spawning. <laughs> Bro, I have two of them up at once. Let's go. Oh, wait. Oh, no, he's friendly. Bro, I'm getting gangbanged over here. Bruh, for real? Okay, I am actually about to die now. I... <laughs> this is fucking terrible, dude. Jesus Christ, yeah, I'm gonna die. Fuck, dude. Oh, they're inside. They're inside, eh? Or C, whatever that is. Oh, God, there's a fucking <laughs> ox beetle over here, too. This is fucking hell and a half, man. <laughs> this ain't good. Uh. Jesus Yo, Christ. Uh, are they, oh, they're on B, I think. Yeah, B hasn't taken any damage. Not a red pop Oh, no, they up, just, like... they got through the first wall. 
but there's still a second a wall. B? Yeah. Oh, B's yours. Okay, yeah, no. Yeah. I didn't. I don't know how much defenses you put in B. Well, we're about halfway. What the fuck do you mean here it comes? It's been here. <laughs> well, we really need these to... Hey, we never did this before. We didn't know how bad it would or wouldn't be. I'm being slowed by, like, fucking mites or something, dude. Okay, I'm gonna retreat for just a moment. Oh, this ox beetle needs to die. Oh no, A A's losing health. Where at? Where okay. at? Where at? Where you at? Can defend A, I can yeah, kill this I'm ox getting, beetle. I'm getting A. I'm inside the ox beetle. I'm making love, not war. They're like going through Wait, the fucking repair? wall. Wait, can you repair? Can you repair A? I don't know. I'm gonna try. We're halfway there. Whoa. What the fuck is attacking A? Okay, the defenses are down on A, though. I don't know what the fuck is attacking it, though, dude. No, cannot repair while under attack. Shit. Bro, there's literally nothing here attacking it, but it's losing health. Like, I'm at A. There's so many enemies, I can't tell, I, it won't, the health bar's gone. I can't see. Oh, there it is. It's back. Oh, wait. There's a mite. Was the mite what was attacking A? No, there's something else attacking A. Okay, I really want to get the, the map mutation equipped real quick. All right, mutations. Uh, blah. Equip that one. Where's Mant? Oh, Owner, God, this is not good. Robe. Mysterious Stranger equipped. Yo, those drinks heal you like crazy, by the way. Really? It didn't do a ton for me, man. I'm not going to lie. This is going to give me PTSD. Oh, God. B and C are both being hit hard, dude. Yeah, mine's down. Fences are down. <laughs> not doing good. Thank God for Mant, dude. Somehow a mosquito flew in here. Okay, I'm heading over to A now. Because A's about to fucking go down, down. Oh, there's a giant fucking black ox beetle over here. That's why. Bro, I can't see. There's so much goo and shit. Oh, Jesus. I'm going to A. A's Jesus. A yeah, way. I know. A's about to fucking go down, dude. It's so fucking bad. Everything. Yeah, we oh, will. Shit. Yeah, A's fucked, dude. A's down. Fuck, dude. Oh, dude. Why can't it just fucking end? Fucking mosquitoes get off the fucking thing. No, dude. Ah. Bro, <laughs> Bro look yep. at all the How fucking many mats. <laughs> <laughs> That's fucking awesome, dude. <laughs> Mant is OP as shit. Uh, I feel like I should equip Ant Annihilator as well. Uh, also, my thing's about the bridge. Fuck, dude. I need a mosquito beak. Oh, God. I'm sure there's one around here somewhere. There's one. That's Surpri Surprisingly, I don't have a mosquito beak either. I also need a repair. I, didn't, I wasn't picking up nothing. Oh, he's Neither still alive. Oh, wait, there he is. Okay, I got one. Uh, repair. Wait, it says I don't have it. What? 
Oh, I need a regular. I have a tiger. Shouldn't it take... It takes a regular? Are you kidding me? That's what it says. I mean, we're probably going to have to... I mean, I guess we don't need to go home home. Or doesn't scale. Oh, huh. That's interesting. I'm not saying let's save scum, but I'm saying let's save scum. Well, if we save scum, it's going to take us back before the fight. Like, before the building, I mean. Oh, shit. So there's no point in save scumming. Especially since a lot of the materials are dropped whenever something's destroyed. Not all of them, but... Yeah, I don't think my shrooms got dropped. Oh, no, there's some did. over there. Some yeah. bricks. Looks like it's ready to go. Wait. No, we gotta restart it. Oh, okay. It's just because I fixed the I... one, so I was saying that we can do the thing again. I need mosquito beak, man. No, don't even fight me, Ant. Get the hell away. I don't want to hit you. My shit's going to break. I need mosquito beak too. Sadly. I mean, so your brick wall is definitely held up better, but not enough. <laughs> uh. Oh, that's flooring. Hear me out. We build so many walls, we can just hide inside of it and not have to fight anything. <laughs> That's what I was hoping with the double wide walls, but apparently, dude, they fucking rip through that shit. I don't think it'll work. Like, I, th we would have to build so much fucking shit for that to work. <laughs> like, <laughs> it's not impossible, but holy fuck. Fuck, dude. I should probably run home and get mosquito beaks. Do you want to try this one more time? Not tonight, no. We're going to have to spend the next it. stream basically just building defenses all day. Sadly, I don't want to, but yeah. But I don't see any other way. That was actually pretty brutal. Yeah, mister. It won't be that bad. Last two I bosses. I did not say it wouldn't be that bad. I just said, yeah, the last two bosses weren't bad. I think specifically what I said was watch it not be that bad. After doing all this. Oh, I watched it was, it though. <laughs> yeah, it was. Oh, fuck. Being attacked by a fucking ant. Go away. Fucking punch you to death, you piece of shit. What the fuck is juicy? Like a true book bookworm, you can't resist a wall of text. It just gives you the moist status. Are you moist? Oh. You retain water better. Oh, okay. Shitty that you can't repair stuff while it's being attacked. <laughs> it makes sense that you can't, but man, it would have helped. All right. Fuck, dude. How far are you from home? Because I do need to get off. I'm not super. Why? I didn't. Yeah, I didn't even start because you acted like we weren't gonna oh, go. Okay. No, I, I, I asked can't. how far you were from home. To grab the mosquito bees, because yeah. I thought that's where you were going. Oh, no, I just stayed up here. We oh, can okay. do that next time. Okay. Wait, you aren't helping fix shit? Not right now. We're doing that next time. Bruh, I mean, I was still fixing shit oh while we God. were just standing around and whatnot. I'm I fixing walls, rebuilding some new walls. <laughs> this guy. Oh, damn. Debating what the best ones would be. I feel like Ant Annihilator. 
good. I don't know. The ants aren't that bad to deal with. But it'd be quicker to go through them. A little bit, yeah. Especially if I, I got uh, mastery of it now. Mant is definitely OP. Like, 100% yeah. Mant. And then I'm taking Honestly, Parry Master, because being I'm able to parry I'm probably going to take Parry Master like... off, because I'm attacking so much, I don't block. The big guys, I still had to block against. The little guys, yeah, whatever, but... Heat Blade Master. You know what's surprising? I probably shouldn't say it. What? Fucking NVIDIA broadcast didn't fuck up this time. Oh. <laughs> My god, it takes forever to repair your mushroom walls, dude. I kind of want to try Shocking Dismissal. Blocked what attacks is that? convert their energy to static electricity, occasionally unleashing a powerful burst. Oh, that is cool. But you were just saying you don't block, so... Yeah, I know. But I need something else. I guess a poison resist. Alright, yeah. I didn't realize how long it was going to take to fix all your mushroom walls, so I think we are going to have to do this next time, too. Wow. Well, alright. All right. Thank you, everyone, for coming and hanging out a little bit while we played some more Grounded. Hopefully... It's almost done. <laughs> Hopefully. Uh, so we can start playing some Baldur's Gate and shit. I'll be back on Sunday to play some PS2 games of some sort. Most likely Scooby-Doo Night of 100 Frights. Uh, there's a good like 200 and uh, basically like 300 out of 320 chance. So pretty, pretty, pretty good uh, chance of it there. Anyways, <laughs> those of you that can be there, I hope to see you there. Those of you who can't, uh, have a good night. Bye, y'all, and be kind to each other. I always forget that shit. You gonna say bye? Bye. <laughs> God. No! Sorry, Al. The one with the lamp calls the shots. I don't have a choice. <laughs>